Hi everyone. In today's episode of Insight in a Minute, we have a very interesting insight to uncover. Have you ever thought about trying to match your performance uh, with your competition's performance, uh, maybe the top competitors in your category, so that you know you can improve your sales and eventually also think about overtaking them? But before that, let's talk about their current numbers. Let's try to figure out their current numbers so that we can set goals to achieve those numbers and then eventually think about overtaking them. So we can do this analysis on Explorazor. Let's see how we can do it. So first, let's choose the brands that we want to compare ourselves against. So Alpha Supplement is our brand followed by uh, competitions, uh, competition brands like Better Boost. And there's another brand uh, which is a competitor called True Women. So these are certain brands that I typically compare myself against. So I'm going to compare their market sales value, which is the the value of it. And I want to look at their current quarter's performance. So I can see what kind of uh, performance have they achieved uh, for, you know, whatever efforts they might have put in. So I can see that Alpha Supplement is the lowest amongst the lot because we are comparing ourselves with the top ones. And True Woman is the highest. So I want to see what kind of numeric and weighted distribution have they uh, achieved in order to achieve this market sales value. And I click on ask by adding those metrics. I want to compare this and uh, convert this into a scatter plot because this can really help me compare myself against the competition. So I can see that true woman is the highest, which translates into a good value of take. So their numeric distribution is nine and weighted distribution is around 50 followed by a uh, better boost with a numeric of around three and weighted of around 30 and then alpha supplement. So for starters, I can aim to, uh, you know, improve my numeric and weighted distribution for the ease zone. So we are looking at the ease zone. So for the numeric, for the ease zone, I can try to, you know, achieve, you know, the metrics of better boost and then eventually true woman. So this is an interesting insight because then the entire brand team of alpha supplement can aim to achieve this number in specific zones and then go about improving themselves or ranking higher in the entire category. So here we go. This was insight in a minute. Stay tuned for more such insights.